Uh, today is the oddest political launch uh, any of us have ever seen in Alberta for a long, long time for a person running for a party. Jason Kenney, the latest savior for the Progressive Conservatives, arrives on the scene at a big event of extremely well-organized, very enthusiastic, almost revivalist, but his message is that he wants to lead the PC party in order to join and merge it with the Wild Rose Party. Uh, how this works, we don't know because we've never seen anything like it in provincial politics in Alberta. It's been done in other provinces, Saskatchewan and BC. It can work, but it's, it's a very odd thing to do to say, I am the candidate for leadership of your party. By the way, that contest doesn't even formally begin for at least two months. And what I'm gonna do when I'm leading your party is march it over to Wild Rose, knock on the door, and say, let's work out a union of the two. Now, the crazy part of this is that it might actually work. Uh, you had the oddest feeling, or I did anyway, at this event that, that it was really not about the PC party at all. It's, it's about a much larger cause. It's about uniting the right in order to defeat the NDP. And, and this has clearly uh, gathered a lot of enthusiasm around Jason Kenney. He might actually be able to do this. He might actually be able to present himself to PCs as the person who wants to lead them and basically use them as a vessel, a little rowboat, if you like, to take over to Wild Rose and, and work something out with them. Uh, very strange, but such are the times, and so many people are so upset about the economy and, and to some measure as well with the NDP that Jason Kenney, uh, the unlikeliest <laughs> candidate for a political party leadership we have ever seen, at least in the style he's doing it, may actually make it happen.